Okay, so what we've got here is a low lick. Um, you know, it's played using the um, the E blues scale here on the sixth, fifth, and fourth string. And we're going to start out playing the G note, which is the third fret on the sixth string. And then we're going to hit our open fifth string, which is an A note, hammer on to this B flat at the first fret, and then a B at the second fret. This is all on the fifth string. The first note's on the sixth string, and then we move to the fifth string. And that's the rhythm. Make sure that you hear every note clearly. Um, you know, a lot of times when you start playing uh, faster hammer-on licks, um, you know, or pull-off in your licks, uh, you have a tendency not to hear each note clearly. And, or, you know, I want you to play this slowly so that you can really focus on getting each note to sound um, on its own. <laughs> And after we get to that point, we're going to hit our open fourth string. And then we do this little move here, which is an, um, a hammer on and pull on, a hammer on and pull off combination here on the fifth string at the first fret. So open to the first fret and then open. I'm only picking once. Watch my picking hand here. Okay, and then I'm coming back to the um, G note here on the third fret of the sixth string. And then we're going to do a similar uh, hammer on and pull off combination, but this time we're going to be on the fourth string, second fret, from the open to the two to the open. And there's the rhythm of it. And then we're going to uh, play the note here on the uh, fifth string, second fret. And then we're going to do that same little hammer on pull off that we did before on the open fifth string to the first fret back to the open string. Then we're going to go to the G note here on the uh, third fret, sixth string. Pull off to the open E, and then play the octave, which is you know an E also here, fourth string, second fret. So this is what we've got. Mm -hmm. 